Hi, so one of you guys have asked me for a quick tutorial on how I make swept and swept slash tapered wings. So I'm just going to do one real quick. Uh, create a sketch on the right side. I'm going to create a quick parameter. We'll do chord half. Let's do half chord. We'll do so 12 inches. Okay. Sketch. This will be the side profile of the wing. Just something fast. Zoom out a bit. All right. You can uh, make your side profile, whatever you want it to be, but I'm just leave it as that. I'm going to come out, create a second sketch on top. So uh, draw it out. So say your wing has some sort of a, we'll say it's got some sort of uh, sweep to it. Uh, you're going to want some sort of a mid section. Um, a line that goes down the midpoint, and then you're going to want to define the leading edge and the trailing edge of your wing. Uh, uh, the front thing, this will just be a construction line. Let's do sweep. This will be in degrees, 15. Let's do 15 degrees. Okay. place. Ouch. That's not what I wanted. Drag that out a bit. Fix that line. Alright, so that should be everything locked in place. And if we don't want any taper to the wing, I'll just set to two times chord. Okay. Now, once you have all of that set up, you can go ahead, go into uh, first sweep. Sweep, there you go. You're gonna select the wing profile, um, the path, you're gonna wanna hit the center path, and we're gonna do path plus guide rails. Um, select, oops, looks like I forgot something. Um, We'll go back into sketch two, make sure that the end of it is a construction line. That just helps the sweep calculate properly. Back at the sweep. Pro path. Guide rail. Select. Let's do full extents. There we go. Okay. Then basically now we have a swept wing. Yeah, hit OK here. If we change our parameter, say like 30 degrees, right, we're gonna have a more swift wing. If we want to do a taper in addition to that, we can go back into here and we can set this to, let's do like 1.4 times. Okay, oops, and now, the leading edge obviously has sweep, but of course the whole wing will taper um, as well. Just one thing to note, um, when you do have these taper, uh, these tapers, your cord height, oh, sorry, not cord height, uh, your camber is going to change, so it's like 44 millimeters out front, and at the base it is... 62 so that will be 62 times 1.4 gets you down there so just keep in mind that not only does it shrink your length but it's also going to shrink your height if you do a taper with sweep uh, that's just a quick tutorial on how i make my swept and swept slash tapered swept and tapered wings thanks very much for watching